the other day we went to the house for food. There were two small kids to some family. The second child was hardly five, six months, eight months. So naturally everybody's attention was there. Now his brother, who was about five, six years, he will come again and again. Suppose something I am talking to him, he will also come like that. Why? Seeking attention. Mind also plays the same game. Therefore, don't entertain suggestions given by the mind. Then what is to be done? Expertise is there. What? Postpone. Asa karte, tomorrow we'll do this room. Today we'll sit here only. See? Reject all suggestions of the mind. Therefore, then yadartham satatam brahma kara vrittim pushyami. So, brahma kara vritti means what? Brahman is akarless, without shape. So now we are practicing what it is like being formless. Now be attentive. When we are practicing sthula kash, gross space, contents were of no consequences. Now we are practicing mind space. Meaning what? We are giving the mind to contemplate on something infinite. Infinite has no space. So the mind is now entertaining. What is infinite? That which has a form is defined. That which is influenced by time is defined. That which has got attributes is defined. So what is the infinite? which doesn't fall in the purview of time, space and object. Mind will not be able to entertain any thought. Yet old habit will bring the thoughts. But now we are playing mind, space, mind, space. Let the thoughts come and go. Who cares? Don't fight with the mind. Then one day we will discover to whatever we have given importance, thoughts come only about that. If we have given importance, we have to delete it. 